The hymen is a thin fold of mucous membrane located at the vaginal opening. This clinical overview explores its anatomy, structure, and physiological function from an evidence-based medical perspective. The hymen lies at the boundary between the external vulva and the internal vaginal canal. During fetal development, it forms as a residual membrane from the junction of the urogenital sinus and the developing vagina. In cross-section, it appears as a thin crescent of mucosa composed of stratified squamous epithelium and a fibroelastic core. Its layers include non-keratinized epithelium, lamina propria, and capillary networks that maintain elasticity and natural coloration. Small arteries and capillaries nourish the hymenal tissue. These delicate vessels explain why minor bleeding may occur after mechanical trauma. Fine sensory fibers from the pudendal nerve provide limited tactile sensitivity, primarily at the hymenal rim. The hymen's fibroelastic composition allows stretching without tearing. Its behavior resembles other mucosal folds throughout the human body. Anatomical variation is completely normal, with shapes including annular, crescentic, fimbriated, and septate forms. Hormonal changes significantly modify hymenal tissue throughout life. Estrogen increases vascularity and elasticity during reproductive years, while decreased hormone levels lead to tissue thinning. After childbirth, the hymenal membrane remodels into small mucosal remnants. In clinical medicine, examination focuses on anatomical shape, tissue elasticity, and absence of pathological lesions not on cultural assumptions or sexual history. Rare developmental anomalies may require minor surgical correction. The hymen is a normal anatomical structure that is dynamic, variable, and self-healing. Understanding its biology supports accurate medical education and evidence-based clinical practice.